when Joyce says to me, we need time. We need, we time. need time. You know, we do have responsibilities and we have a son. And so in order to get away, we couldn't do this on our own. We needed help. And so my sister, who was my matron of honor in our wedding, she took the time to make arrangements to do something special uh, with with our son, even so that he didn't feel like he was being left out, but that it was special time for them. She was creative even in that. She invested in our marriage. And so I'm challenged, what can we do to invest in other people's marriages to make it possible for them to get away? Um, even if it's a quick getaway, what can we do to help somebody else? Could you maybe offer to have a child or a dog or a cat, watch them for the weekend, <laughs> just so that they can have a chance to connect and reconnect with each other through the Word of God, or even just spending time in prayer, or just even sitting in the car and chatting. Go to a movie, go out to dinner, <laughs> go sit on the couch and have that cup of coffee that Joyce is gonna brew for you. Hey, you know what? We can sit on somebody else's couch while their kids are sleeping, and all our, our distractions will be gone and we have time. So we can invest both ways, how about that? That's a great idea. We've <laughs> actually babysat for, for a couple as they went out, and it gave us a chance to be alone and together. In, in and a different share. environment than our home. It yes. was kind of fun. So we'd love to hear from you. Take the opportunity to, to comment underneath this video and let us know how you're creatively spending time with each other and offering your services and your gifting to others too. We want to hear. We want to get some dialogue going. Yes. Marriage is a God's gift and you can make a difference in making your marriage work. She's a serious priority. <laughs> I'll make sure he knows it. <laughs>